Hi there smartphone fans, welcome back for another honest hands-on review here on Smartphone Wars. And if you're looking for the ultimate budget phone right now, big battery, big display, 18 by 9 aspect ratio, global 4G LT that works in the US as well, and a below $200 price, I might have the best solution for you here, and this is the Umi Digi S2. This is my unboxing and first impressions video of the phone. You can check out the specs 6 inch HD plus 18 by 9 display with a 5100 milliamp power battery. Now, this is a huge, huge display, but the phone is actually not that big. And it's very important what you get inside the package. Yumi Digi have put an amazing package here for just below $200. You get inside the USB Type C cable. And you also get the 3.5 millimeter to USB type C headphone jack converter since the phone doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, but it has the Nest Pack Sting, a converter supplied in the box. You also get the best case I've ever seen packed in the box of a phone, not your regular silicone case, but a very nice soft CPU case for it. And the phone also comes with a fast charging brick charger that should charge the phone in around three hours with a huge battery. But enough about the packaging, let's talk more about the phone itself. The Yumi Digi S2 is a very, very fine crafted phone. It's super solid, it's got weight, it's probably around 200 grams. It's not as heavy as the Verni Mix 2, but it has a bigger battery. And this uh, skin-like feel soft case for it is perhaps the best case I've ever seen packed inside a phone ever. It just fits right in and makes the phone feel a lot better in your hand. And the phone is made out of metal on the back, not a glass phone. Since I know some of you really hate those glass phones, including myself. And this is a dual camera setup with the rear fingerprint scanner. The phone, I'm pretty sure, does have that 5000 mAh power battery because it's not the thinnest and it's not the lightest phone around. But it's absolutely just right for this huge 6 inch phone and you can check out below the USB type C and speaker grill along with a noise cancelling microphone and on the other side you have the SIM tray and volume and power rockers just look at that incredible huge display almost as good as any AMOLED panel out there very punchy colors the display gets very bright and I love that Samsung navigation keys on the bottom and check out those thin sides and top and bottom bezels. Incredible. And so the phone definitely has some protection coating like Gorilla Glass on top, but I cannot confirm which version it is. And since I already mentioned that this phone with LT works, this is a full blown package. This has global 4G LT and it will probably work in like everywhere around the world because this supports all the bands, including US. Africa, Asia and Europe type band. So if you're looking for a great phone to import below $200 and you want to absolutely make sure 4G works in your country, the Umi Digi S2 is one of the best choices on the market right now from China. You get a 5.99 inch HD plus 18 by 9 display, first ever in a sub $200 phone. You also get 4 gigs of RAM, 64 gigs of onboard storage, the Helio P20, which is an octa-core chipper at 60 nanometers, so it's a very good chip at this price. And of course, you do what's really important is that you have all the sensors. This phone has gyroscope and everything, proximity sensor, it does have a notification LED as well. And the camera, the back camera, it's Sony IMX258 with an additional camera just for that depth of field effect. So it's two cameras, it doesn't use them at the same time. And the front camera is uh, a 5 megapixel Galaxy Core sensor. The first new to run was actually pretty decent. It did get over 60,000 points. So this is definitely Helio P20. The monster display not only is 18 by 9, but also has the deepest blacks I've ever seen in an IPS panel at this price range. And the punchiest colors. Definitely better than the Super AMOLED in the Vernito Plus. So great for that. And it also supports mirror vision. Thanks to mirror vision, you can fine tune every aspect of this great display, enable dynamic contrast, and it even has a blue light filter for reading. So this is, I think, the best display you can get at this price. Simply incredible. Moving on, the ROM is multi-language, which is great. 
so another plus for those looking to import your phone and support their language and i'm glad to report the umi dg s2 features customizable led and you can change the on-screen navigation keys as well but i did find out that the phone is running android 6.0 marshmallow but i think umi dg might update that to nougat very very soon but this is something you will want to know and now check out the sound quality And of course, let's take a quick tour through the camera app on the Umi DG S2. It's the stock MTK camera app. The sensor is 13 megapixel. You can have HDR and live shot enable. The phone actually has a manual mode, which you can think around with a lot of settings, but it, you can't change the exposure time on the sensor, which is a pity. The phone, I did shoot a few pictures. Uh, the quality looks okay, but for me, I don't think this is definitely a world beater when it comes to cameras. Uh, the good side is that the phone can record 4K video with its main camera and Full HD with the front camera. So this has been it for my Umi DG S2 unboxing. You can buy the phone from the link in the description below. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe to my channel for more honest hands-on reviews and look forward to my full review next week. Also share the video that your friends can watch it as well. Stick around.